Guess what time it is? It's not wet willy time, but uh, I've got 792 jellies to sell. Think you can find something better than that? I'm not so sure. Here. Sure, I can find what you just gave me and get it back to you, because reasons. I'm not really a value customer of yours, Pierre. I don't really do anything. I need to go to buy cactus fruits today. I probably need to buy 1,400 of them. I now have seven buildings. Well, I mean, I have nine built, but only seven are actually filled. The other two are not. I'm rolling around all of my profits just back into making these freaking preserved jars, so at least this one's full now. Um, the other ones won't be done till today sometime, so it'll cut into the time it takes to actually grow them. I planted about a hundred of these pine trees just so I'd have, you know, extra growth. Um, because, you know, I need wood, and I'm tired of buying it all the time. You can never tell if these have spawned seeds or not. And I probably should just put walkways down so they don't spawn, but that takes up stone. And, um... I don't really have a lot of extra stone right now. But these grew. I planted these a little while ago. This just sprung up on its own. I don't think these are growing too well, to be honest. But so they grow into bushes, and then it just takes them forever to grow past that. Um, let's see. Does anything need to happen in town? Well, I need to buy another shed from Robin. I can sell some cherry wine, which doesn't sell for a whole lot. Yeah. Buy 300 wood, which is annoying. Did I put wood in here? Some. I didn't want to. I still have all this, but I need it, so I don't know. I don't have that much coal, but I was making some coal. 79 of it. Um, I could make one more. I have an even number here, but hey. Uh, boom. There you go. Let's make that one extra piece, and then I'll have enough for ten more pots, I suppose. It's useful to... Eh, I don't know. Should I make more seeds or not? I can make more fall harvest seeds. Um, it's 27 of those, and 12 of those. I mean, for fall harvest seeds, that's what you need, brown mushrooms. And fall harvest isn't anything I really need to grow in fall anyway. Uh, what more? Um, I don't know. So just throw these in there and get ready for fall, I guess. I only have one seed maker. I could have swore I had two. No, I've got two. I got two seed makers. All right, cool. It's not really a good luck day, so seed generation is going to be a bit low. But anyway, I need to go to Pierre's and sell this jelly. Oh, hi. Yeah, might as well plug it. I'm not picking up salmon berries, though. So not worth it. Cheap as shit to sell. They don't, they don't give me anything, and I have enough energy, so I'm good. Okay, come on. Let me buy 300 wood from you, and then one more shed. I think 10 sheds would be fine. I don't really want any more sheds than that. So... 300 wood, 15,000, so, you know. 300 is... 100 is 1,000, so that's... Isn't it? 10 wood, 300 wood. There you go, 3,000, see? Plus 15,000. My sheds are basically costing me 18,000. Anyway, this is... 9, 10. 10 sheds. And ten sheds is basically all I care about. I should make them two rows of five apiece. So I've done that. Uh, if you're wondering about the... I had a money jump. I actually broke all of the geodes that I had. And I made, made about uh, 40,000 out of that. Which is nice. But right now we have to go and handle selling jellies to... Let's just do it. Let's do it. 221,000. It's already been sold, but the animation is still going on. Kind of pleases me to see all that. 
But I need to buy about 1,400 cactus fruits. So, yay. Anyway, it's Tuesday. Pam will be there. I bought another sprinkler from Probus. There she is. I don't really care about making her go faster because I want to pluck this. This. I don't care about the berries. I don't even care about the foraging. I'm doing my own thing. This actually doesn't net you a whole lot of profit. I mean, I'm rolling my profit back around to the sheds, but even so, I'm not making that much profit off of all of this. I think I'm only going to make like 80000 a week. This is only a good you know, four weeks. That's It's not even 400000 in, in a in a month for all of this cactus fruit. It's just no effort. That's it. These trees aren't fully grown yet. Another week they might be. Oh, look. Pluck. So I need to buy about 1,400 of these things. It's a lot of cactus fruits. You won't find these goods anywhere else. Yeah. I'll have the money for star fruits coming up. So, you know. I mean, this right here is... I'm still good. I actually need like 1380. And I have some left over, but I'll still buy 1400. It'll make me feel happier. Two, three, 1400. It's a little less, but I'll just throw one of these in if I have to. And there goes all the money. There goes all of the money back into cactus fruits because I'm spending it all on sheds. I still have three sheds to outfit. So, you know. I don't even need this crap. I guess I could empty out my foraging chests. I don't really need any of the crap that I'm picking up. Oh look, he was hiding. How cute. The only rare crow I don't have yet is the one from the casino, so whatever. I got three coconuts and five iridium. Oh, there was a thing over there. Ah, eh, whatever. No artifact could possibly spawn here anyway. That I need. The artifact I need hasn't even <laughs> hasn't spawned. It should be in this area right here. See that? Oh, what the? <laughs> oh, yes. Well, that takes care of the last artifact. Um. <laughs> Uh, Gunther, on a, on a really shitty, shitty luck day, I found the really rare 1% artifact. Yeah. And look, it seems I need, I still need six books. Apparently, I still need six books. This is the last artifact. New achievement, a complete collection. I guess I could collect the rewards. Of, oh, yeah, of course, I want to collect that and that. Look, you can, this is the only time... If you scroll over it, you automatically use it. You could actually sell that if you don't scroll over it and have the inventory open. But I don't recommend it. Because you only get seven in the game. So apparently there's still some books to find. But I don't know. It's been a while and I haven't found any books. Maybe that is all the books. Maybe there's no books on the right shelf. And I just think I remember there being books on the right shelf. But there you go, guys. I did not expect to find that at all. Especially on a shitty luck day. But this is the only place you could find it, and I found it. Um, I'm not sure how to feel now that I've completed the collection. Where's my other skull? My other skeleton somewhere. I don't know. Um, well, we can start making the jelly now. Um, one of my sheds is still iffy because I started it late. Okay, see, this one still has two hours. Mm. So... It's 66, right? I have a calculator right here. So you see, 66, it's not three. It's just uh, two this time around, 132. But if it were times three, you know, it would be 198. But uh, I think it's just 132, because 66 is 1232. So let's do 132 like we're supposed to. There. 132. 
one, two, 136, 132. Yeah, I know. There. Seven, you know, that's that's what you get here. And I have I still have all of these. And if you divide that by seven, that's um it's six. Four hundred and twenty. So you could throw six more in each one, you know. But there. Eh. No, I don't want to eat the cactus fruit. I just want to put it in there. But they're going to make more jelly, and I'll actually have a turnaround today on jelly. I think they just popped. The other ones did. It's two hours down the road, you know. I actually think I could have bought more cactus fruit than I did. One hour, 30 minutes. The other one is a lot longer. Why is it a lot longer? Well, because I started it later. This one? Yeah. So, oh, it hasn't even begun yet. Well, it'll actually, it'll be an hour and a half earlier, won't it? Might as well put 66 back in here. There. There. Um, and I still have more to go. So, you know, I divide that by 7. 7 times 6 is 42. So... Actually, I think it's supposed to be 60. So another 60. So it's almost 66, right? Man, I should have bought more. I feel sad. Um, I just thought I had extra ones. You know? I probably don't. Yeah, I'm not going to have enough. So, that didn't work out too well. Yeah, see, I have six more, but I don't have enough for the seventh, you know. These sell for 150, so I can still make more the old-fashioned way. Well, anyway, this is the seventh one. You're going to be done before everybody else. Yeah. And you are blank, so yay. Well, if you're going to be done two hours for everybody else, you might want the other 66. But I'm old-fashioned, what can I say? I'll just put him in this one. An extra 66. In one hour, we get a slowed ton more jellies. Hmm. So this is what we're doing with our summer. Not a single crop, man. I could have done crops. I, I could have done rhubarb, which is a really profitable crop. But it's already half over, you know? Automate mod just makes this so much more simple. And I know it's technically cheating because people who have this game on Switch or something can't do this. But I fell in love with the automated mod because I like industry. So it's kind of hard for me to just give it up. I don't think I have 66 fruits, cactus fruits floating around in my um, forge bin. Now I have 47. I mean, that's um, one more that I need. So I could do this and pluck that one in there. And then that's it right there. And I don't have any more cactus fruits. 
But you don't use cactus roots for anything. So, 46. 56, 66. I mean, if you want 66 more, that's basically 30 right here. And so you just need 33 more. There. So you have 30 and 33. That makes 66. Uh, and I have 12 more, actually, to go. So I don't really need to do this, but... Eh. Makes me feel happy. To know I actually have enough. My money's down to 120. If I could grow enough trees... I won't need to buy anything but stone. It'll cut my costs tremendously. Which will make me happy. But, this is a short episode, I think, because this is all I've done this day, and, well, I can make 10, almost, 78, you know, if I do 16 more pieces of wood, right, I'm 16, uh, 20, then I could, I guess there's some ore here that still hasn't been smelted yet. So that's where all of the coal is going. Um, yeah, I don't mind so much because I'll need that for tappers eventually. And iron sells for okay money. So does gold, but not quite. I mean, you know, I have this stuff. Oh, I have another slime ball I could sell. I break even when I sell those if, if they're green. But hey. Only if I buy them from Krobus at 500 slime balls for 500 bucks. Um, I could go into the mines. The day is pretty short. The mines might give me coal. Uh, they're going to give me ore that I don't want to smelt, obviously. And I can get coal by wood. So Look at that. I've earned 3 million, but I'm only, I've spent so much money on crap. Ugh. And this isn't actually that profitable, all things considered. It can't even get you half a million. Which... All, which you know, maybe with this industry you can do star fruits and it's better. But star fruit wine is, is really good. Star fruit jelly will happen faster. You can do two star fruits. And if you're gonna jelly them, um, in fact, uh, yeah, let's not. Let's just go to um, the wiki for a minute while we have some time, and we'll do um, star fruit jelly. Star fruit. Here it is. Um, a gold star fruit is twelve thirty-seven. I mean, uh, that's only with a tiller profession, which I don't have. I have the. Why did the crops grow faster? I have the artisan profession, but it's not the tiller one. So I don't get the. I don't get that, but the um, star fruit wine uh, starts at well, with the artisan profession. It's thirty-one fifty. So that's a lot. Um, and it takes seven days to make wine, you know, jelly, you can, jelly is more profitable than even a gold star fruit if you don't have the tiller profession. So that's fine. The wine itself though is a lot of money. You grow your star fruits. I have enough to do... If these sheds get full, I could do 660 of them in one week. And 660 star fruit seeds, though, is expensive because they're 400 a piece. If I remember this correctly, uh, yeah, they're 400 a piece. Uh, so just do the math on that. If I need to buy 660 of them at 400 a piece. That's 66,000 plus, it's over 100,000. Like, I'll, I'll show it to you. Here's the math. If I need to buy 660 of these at 400 apiece, I have to spend 264,000 to grow 660 of them. Now, I have 36 iridium sprinklers right now, maybe 40. Uh, 36 times 24, 864 crops. 
Um, I have enough iridium sprinklers to do all that, but I would need about 250,000 by summer one. I can get that, especially if I'm not upgrading these anymore. Um, so I need 250,000 seed, seed money and then make it all jelly. Uh, none of these are kegs because I can't really craft kegs. Kegs are just hard to craft. I mean, you need oak resin and I don't have an oak farm. Um, so it's gonna have to be jelly. It's gonna have to be 400. And my jelly artist in profession makes it, uh, you know, let's go back to the jelly. Uh, 2170 is what it makes it. Minus 400 to buy. So that's uh, 2070 times 1770. And if you want to do the math on that, it's, uh, I just closed my calculator. Stupid me. So my profits are 1770 right there. That's my profits on the jelly. And I can only do that twice. Uh, times 660 times two. So that would just make that times uh, 13, uh, 20. So you're gonna make 1.7 million. Yeah. 17 million. Well, it's 660 of them times two, times two harvests. Is that many? And if I'm gonna do 17, again, minus 400, so 1770 times 1770. Yeah, okay, 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 yeah, yeah, two million. That's, that's more like it. Enough for the return scepter in summer's end. No cactus fruits. But the cactus fruits are fine for now. And then in fall I can do, um, well that's just those crops. So my plans are probably to do some wheat. I, could, I can't make donuts until after summer. And I won't have the tap or wood until then either. So maybe I can start doing donuts uh, third year and show you what donuts are like, okay? Uh, you need at least 100 trees tapped. Um, I would say 200 trees. But you also need farm space for like uh, uh, 400 crops. Which I'll have the farm space for, I hope. Um, that's something I can do. Do I have the farm space for this? I get rid of these. These are just uh, this. This is just my tree farm down here. So I can actually get rid of all of this. Do I have enough for 36 of those? And I probably do enough space. So it's my tree farm. I'll wall this off. I need stone though, so. I mean, it's five across and five down. So all you have to do is just check five across. I was gonna put a pathway where I'm standing. So this one right here, there's a pathway here and a pathway here. So here, I mean, it's five across. It's one, two, three, four, five. And then all you need is, um, if I do 10 of those across, then I just need three down. That's uh, six across right there. So if I can do six across and six down, that would be fine. But if I can do six across here and three up and three down, or even here, one, two, three, four, five. So there you go, There's this is one. So can I do... Barely. I can do a six by six in this area right here. Um, I'd have to move the sheds, but I can do that. So I can do a six by six iridium and do that that way. Um, Junimos would harvest, but I don't really care about Juminos. Juminos. So a six by six will give me all I need. That's 36 and I have enough for that. So yeah, we got our summer plan. You have my plans and maybe I'll do wheat or something also in the summer as a side project. Because wheat's fine, I need a bunch of that, and I also need a bunch of uh, sugar beets, which is fall. So, I think it's the fall. Yeah. Yeah, beets. Beets are probably summer. I don't think beets are spring. Um, I probably have a beet or two I could hover over and look at really quick. Um, I don't know. I don't think I have any beet seeds. I think I planted them all. Oh, the cat didn't get pet. Okay. Nope, I have no beet seeds. Yes, I do. 
Plant these in the fall. Yeah. Okay, so it's a fall fruit. So yeah, you know. I just need wood. Lots of wood. And destroy those trees. So when summer comes I'll have to kill my tree farm when moves are draw. To plant a six by six rose back to squeeze in a little bit more somewhere else. That's my plan, so I'm done for today. I will record next week when um, I have enough resources to maybe I'll, I'll outfit one more of those sheds and that will be fine and then every week I can do that so for the last two weeks of the season I can outfit sheds seven and eight and then have the money I need to buy the star fruits and outfit shed I mean sheds not eight and nine then, then outfit shed ten okay that's what I'm trying to do that's what I'm trying to do I will see you week three of spring away.